Okay, this is the box that the mattress comes in. This is a full-size mattress. We paid $500 for it. So we'll see what's inside. Okay, and this is what the mattress looks like. Fresh out of the box, it's still in its plastic wrap. That's what this crazy thing looks like. We're going to have to figure out how to get this plastic off of it. I don't know how I'm going to film the actual removal of the plastic, but we'll see what happens. So yeah, we accidentally punctured the uh, this wrapping when we were unplugging it and it's already starting to inflate inside the wrapping. You can hear it, which is sort of fun. Yeah. yeah, I don't know if you can hear that on the camera, but it's sort of zany. And also, look, there's a pillow in there. Okay, so where do we want to start with this hole? The edge. It's good. Oh, look how fast it yeah. mm. blows right up. Alright, so this is what the bed looks like in its fully inflated state. Or it's not actually fully inflated. We, we just popped the uh, plastic off of it about a minute ago. And already it's 90% inflated, I'd say. Probably the, over the next couple, three hours it'll sort of finish out. But it certainly doesn't take very long for the thing to, to blow up into a, sleepable, into a sleepable arrangement. This is the pillow that was packed in there. It's a shredded latex pillow and it was packed f flat as a flat as a piece of paper or a thick piece of cardboard or something. It was amazingly flat and it blew up just instantaneously. This is what the cover of the mattress looks like. It's made of bamboo. You can see what the detailed sort of stitching looks like. It's very soft pleasant to the touch. The surface, the hand feel of the mattress is pretty it's pretty soft. Um, we haven't laid on it yet so we all know we haven't have, don't really have any impression of how it sleeps but definitely it's got a very soft hand feel. 
and uh, so far everything seems pretty nice for 500 bucks we'll see how it sleeps but uh, that's sort of what the unboxing experience is like on our $500 full-size Brooklyn bedding latex and other foam mattress okay so there's also a lot of discussion on the forums and whatnot about how soft is soft and what is a, a given number on the imaginary 1 to 10 scale represent the, the mattress I ordered is a 5 uh, and we were going for something somewhat firm you can see I do sink pretty significantly into the mattress whenever I lay down on it. It's very soft to my to my reckoning. Um, maybe somewhat softer than I thought I had bargained for. It's very comfortable though, so uh, without making any judgments on how it sleeps, I will say that uh, my expectation was that it would be somewhat firmer. So uh, I weigh just shy of 200 pounds. I'm about 196 pounds. And I'm about five feet seven inches tall, a little shy of five feet seven. So, uh, just to give you an idea, if you're shopping for a mattress, um, that's about how far I sink down into this thing. About probably a good two and a half inches of 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 deflection on the top of the mattress. So yeah, one last thing. Everybody seems to be concerned about the smell. Uh, I guess they've had some experiences or heard stories about memory foam mattresses. Um, this mattress is latex and polyurethane foam. It comes with this little insert. Uh, latex mattresses and toppers are compressed for shipping upon receipt. Remove them from their packaging in a warm room temperature setting. Please allow 24 to 48 hours for your product to recover to full shape. In addition, being sealed in plastic sometimes causes an odor. A few hours of airing usually removes the odor. We didn't really smell any odor at all. It's a very, very, very faint plastic smell. There's nothing obnoxious. It's nothing that you would worry about sleeping on or anything like that. And I'm sure in an hour or less, actually, I already can't smell it anymore. It's it's undetectable.